Hello and welcome to something that I'm really, really looking forward to. Uh, this is a blind playthrough of Journey, released by That Game Company, called That Game Company, um, not too long ago. Uh, I've, I've been fiddling around for a couple of weeks trying to get myself ready <clears throat> to actually put this together, and due to a few technical difficulties, dif difficulties and whatnot, uh, I've had to delay it, but we're finally here. I've heard a lot about this game, and let's get this. Let's just accept this. I've heard a lot about this game, but I don't know a lot about this game. If that makes any sense, it it's had a lot of praise put on it, and then uh, it's it, it's the sort of game that I think is is something that I would really really enjoy. So I'm really really looking forward to this. And, and because I, I didn't want to play it until I could actually record it as well, so um, you know, so we could do something a little bit different this time. And this is is completely blind, apart from a quick trailer that I saw. I don't know a lot about the game. I don't really know what I have to do. So we'll uh, see how my gaming expertise comes into play here. Apparently, it's a pretty short game as well, so. For these uh, sort of blind run-throughs or playthroughs, it's a pretty good game to start with. And one thing, this game certainly does look pretty. Alright, well, we can use the 6-axis to turn the world, or to turn the character this perspective. Oh, wow. Okay. Online player subject to the journey, uh, which can be using the... Use. Yeah, we've done all that, haven't we? Yeah, so. Uh, the one thing that I have heard about this game is the multiplayer aspect, the way it works. Okay, so that's the circle button. Okay. Um, the, the multiplayer aspect, you people can join you uh, at any given time. But you don't know, <clears throat> you don't see the gamer's tag or anything like that. All you see is um, just their character. And you can't talk to them, you can only use these little gestures like that. Uh, and that's all you have, which I think is really, really cool. Now I want to see what's up here. Oh, okay, I like that. So we can see the whole world around us. Wow. <laughs> well, let's get down there and see what's going on. I have no idea what these things are supposed to be. I'm hoping they're not gravestones. Hmm. The uh, the symbols and whatnot, they reminds me of something a little bit from Twilight Princess. Uh, what have we got going on here? Oh, 
Hold X. Ooh, hello. Okay, fair enough. So now we can jump. And that's that's well, that's more than a jump. That's uh gliding for a, a couple of seconds there. And now I can't jump. Hmm. It's odd. That's mm, that's very weird. So when I see these things, I can jump. Oh wow, look at that. I wonder if I can store them, so... Yeah, so you can store them, I think. Alright, well, leave them there for a moment. I gotta remember to use the six axis to actually look where I'm going. What's this over here? This, this looks like a diner. Very inappropriately placed one. Did it? Um, okay, you can at least hop over ledges like that. Nothing seems to be in here. Uh, I can't climb up there. I guess we'll just carry on our little journey. This is a sort of game I've been wanting to play for a very, very long time. I was, uh... I was playing Tomb Raider 2 a couple of days ago. And I had no idea what the fuck I was supposed to be doing, or how to get anywhere. And it was refreshing, because... So often these days a game will just say, you must do this, you must use that weapon, you must do this. And you don't even really get a chance to actually discover for yourself what you need to do. And uh, and it was refreshing to not have a clue what I was doing. If that makes a whole lot of sense. Now, I'm going to go up here, and I'm going to get my little tokens again. Thank you very much. And then I'm going to go and see what this shiny thing up here is. Because a game that really, really offended me with with doing uh, the whole you must use this weapon and go here it was Arkham City, actually. No! Blast. To the point that I just I was not enjoying the game anymore. Really not enjoying it. And it left me quite disappointed. But there are many, many games like that, so... So if we come from an angle, maybe... There you go. So now what does that mean? Someone tell me. Um, okay. Well. We'll just roll with it for the moment.
let's jump up onto one of these. Let's see what's going on. I'll go through there. Can't go through there. Hmm. Well, so far I'm a little bit stumped with what I need to do, but that's fine. I don't have to show anything up here. to know what that does. Ooh. Hold circle. Well, hello. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's pretty freaking cool. This isn't me struggling to find things to say, this is me... Uh, what, what do you need to say? This is, uh... This is quite beautiful. Now, was that classified as a chapter? Can we... Save, select options, chapters. Oh, we can't chapter select, so we'll just we'll carry on for the moment. I'm guessing that now is the end of the chapter. <laughs>